Thank you, so great to be back. That was a fantastic show. And it's good to be standing here with you again. It's nice to be here with you, Jonathan, and talking about some updates that is coming and other things. And last time we were here, we talked about things that was rolling out and you talked about the new support pieces, uh, and the new support system that we were launching. What has happened? Since last time, I think it's great to see how the chat boot function is really working. We see that we have quite a lot of people using it. Uh, we have also seen that we are now answering twice as many emails as we did at the last time. So the new guys are up to speed and of course it would just improve. And the same thing, of course, with the chat boot, we will continue on improving the service and add more answers, answers and questions to this one as well. Yeah, and over the time since last event, we have also launched quite a lot of things around the legal and compliance departments. We have a new software that is scanning the uh, total internet on uh, social media and other platforms to see everything that is written about us. And legal will handle all the things that is around the external people writing on us and the compliance department will look at what the network, you all, the affiliates are doing around this out there. Positive and negative and come back to you. But I also know that you have been quite for a time now in Sweden, but that's not the place you want to be. It has been because of the Corona shutdown. So uh, I think you have something to, to it's, tell it's, about. it's been some strange times, of course. I mean, uh, this COVID-19. Uh, I really, of course, miss Nigeria. I miss to be able to travel again, as I mentioned before. And I'm so happy to today then present that we are going to office, or open the office in Lagos and in Nigeria. Uh, more information about this will, of course, come in your back office. Uh, but great steps in Africa. In addition to this, we've also done some updates in our back office. So can you tell us a little bit, bit about these updates? Yeah, and the first update we're doing is that we are moving from presenting euros, that is a local European currency, to business points, that is a generic global point system that we are working with. We have them already in the system, so it's nothing new. It's just that we're moving from presenting euros to business points. And we will look at two pictures, two slides, where we can see how it's looking. First, here in the juicer log, you see that we are presenting the BPs instead of the euros. And uh, when you do the purchases in the back office, you will also do that in BPs. And we can look at here, if you should have bought event tickets to this event, it would have been in BPs instead of uh, euros. So that Much is one change. Yeah. yeah. And the other one that is a little bit uh, that you will see is that we are going from presenting amounts around uh, rewards to just presenting the number of rewards you earn in Streamline, you earn in uh, getting the packages, etc. And uh, we could also look at how that would uh, look, because I think you have some pictures for that, Jonas. Yeah? This is in the Streamline. You see how much new rewards you get in the Streamline every week. And uh, remember, claim them, because they're gone the next week if you don't claim them. And then we have the um, the picture of uh, the packages, and here we look at the uh, different numbers of rewards you get in the different educational packages. So that is a change. But we're also doing some other changes that I know that you have a bit uh, to talk about on. We are. We are adding some supporting documents to the back office. Um, I think some of them are really something that we need to make it slightly easier for people. Yeah. Uh, you have some updates around the legal aspects, right? Yeah, there will be a number of new documents, uh, old and new ones, around the legal and compliance things that will be there, like the terms and condition, income disclaimer, privacy policy, all the interesting, fun thing, you know. And there will be a, a huge document called the processes and procedures. And that's a little Bible of how we should work, how we should behave, uh, and that is how the compliance are looking on all of us. So uh, that is, but there are also other type of documents in this section that we're adding. For sure, so we're adding a more robust idea about the business. So you're getting a business presentation in the back office as well. Uh, in addition to that, we're going to add a specific chapter about what we are and what we are not. 
this is extremely key for everyone, uh, for the authorities, but also for you guys when you're out talking about the business. You are not allowed to talk about certain things because we are not selling financial products. Yeah, and that means that together in one place you will have everything, so you can read it easily, you can download the documents, and you can work with them. And there will be new documents, new things coming there all the time. But I think it's time for us to, uh, to start thinking about getting back to the office, starting to work, work hard, like you do all the time, to be able to present new things on the next event that is only in four weeks' time. So thank you, Jonathan, for being sharing the scene with me right thank now. Thank you for having me here.